Thanks for stopping by, everyone. Hope everyone's doing good. Uh, today is pretty simple. It's a unbox, quick install, and uh, just a quick thought video on the Corsair H60. So let's jump into it. Sit back and relax and enjoy another episode of GNC Fix and Play. play, play. So, after doing some upgrades to my PC, I noticed that my PC was running hot, so I wanted to upgrade from the stock cooler that came with the AMD processor, so I decided to go with this Corsair H60. Um, it is, you know, good for, so they say, for an Intel and AMD, and, you know, I was, I was running about 65 degrees Celsius, um, and based on where my computer was prior, that's why I felt I needed this. So let's just see what comes in it. Obviously you got your instruction booklet um, and on the instructions, they do state to mount it as an intake for best results. So that is how we will be doing it. Um, well, let's see what else we got in here. So inside the box, you obviously have one fan, you have the uh, radiator with the pump and your hoses pre-attached, and then you're going to have a couple different brackets, one for AMD, one for Intel, and all the hardware that you're going to need. So it's pretty straightforward. Um, so the only thing you'll have to do now is to try installing it, and we're going to be using the AMD brackets. So let's go into it. So if you're using AMD, uh, if you had the same cooler I had with the two, with like the springs uh, and the screws, you're not gonna be able to use that. You have to use the original ones that have the little clips in the middle because that's how this mounts to an AMD processor. And you'll see as we, as we get to that point, I'm actually installing the, crypt, the clips right now. So just uh, make sure you have those before you get started. Uh, that was a pain point for myself.
Okay, so here we go, and I wanted to test this, so I used a benchmark program uh, just to see how the CPU was running. And as you can see, we got it down. It did spike up to you know 60 every now and then. Uh, underneath, I, I'm guessing that was like a peak load for the system. But generally speaking, it was below 60 degrees um, and dipped down into the 40s. So overall, really happy with it because it did drop it probably on average about 10 degrees. Um, hope this helps you guys make a decision. Uh, do please feel free to leave a comment, uh, drop a like, and click that subscribe button for more videos. So everyone, have a good time.